How are maps created? Where science, art, and imagination come together to draw the world. Creating a map isn't just about tracing roads or outlining borders, it's an ancient and powerful act, giving visible shape to the world around us, transforming landscapes into knowledge, orientation into storytelling. A map is in essence a lens through which we read space, and ourselves. But how is a modern map actually made? Today's cartographers rely on satellites in orbit, high-resolution drones and advanced GPS technologies capable of capturing every detail of the Earth with astonishing precision. These images are translated into geographic coordinates, 3D models of the terrain and complex data sets. Once we explored with a compass, now we explore with pixels, but the world is a sphere and a map is flat. How do we move from one to the other without losing the essence of the land? Through cartographic projections, mathematical systems that convert the Earth's curved surface into a flat plane, each projection has its purpose, its style, its distortion. Just as every map shows the world from a specific point of view, thanks to GIS, Geographic Information Systems software like QGIS, ArcGIS, or Google Earth Pro, geographical data is processed, refined, and transformed into understandable visuals. This is where thematic mapping comes in. Maps can now illustrate anything, climate, traffic, population, biodiversity, natural resources, by layering multiple data sets like transparent sheets over the same base. Every map is also a creative act. It requires visual intuition, design sensibility, and clear communication. Colors, symbols, textures, contour lines, and legends transform raw data into a tool that's not just functional but beautiful and intuitive. A map isn't just useful, it can also be deeply moving. Maps are never truly finished. Every day the world changes, new roads appear, old paths disappear, borders shift, cities evolve. Thanks to artificial intelligence, real-time data, and user contributions, today's digital maps, like Google Maps, are updated almost instantly, offering a living, breathing snapshot of our ever-changing world. Every map is more than a physical representation. It's a spatial narrative, a tool to navigate the world, and sometimes to navigate within ourselves. From the sketch of an archipelago to the emotional map of a story, from ancient navigators' charts to modern thematic maps, the gesture remains the same, giving meaning to the space we inhabit. Because mapping the world is ultimately about understanding it, and learning to belong. If you enjoyed the video, subscribe to the channel and discover more curious and amazing content. Don't miss out. Thank you.